Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me today in Honey, I Joined a Cult. If you haven't watched any of my previous episodes on this game, please go back and check them out. It has been a fantastic game. We are the Fellowship of Friendly Foss, and as you can see, we have been building our compound here for our followers in Dentist. In the last episode, we were, or last two episodes, I should say, having some issues with using the bathroom. So we built the bathroom of tomorrow today. So there you can see is Chief Dentist Tooth and the Scrubbers using the restroom and we have our maintenance tech, Bella, walking around making sure everything is nice and clean and fixed up for us. So day-to-day -day activities continue on here at the Fellowship of Friendly Floss compound. Everyone is coming to visit the dental office right here in the center. We have our meditation studio right here where you can come and hear Great sounds of Sclepius. If you need to visit anyone from the past that has uh, since gone to the other side, you can see them here through our, uh, what do we call this room here, the spirit chamber. And lastly, we have our energy spa where you can get some therapy through energy. It looks like one of our dentists was just injured for not washing their hands. What a dope, but that's okay. Energy spa's going there. Look at everyone getting uh, relaxed there. There's our spirit, uh, what are they saying? Couldn't quite read that on the other thing behind everything. And meditation and the dental office are moving and a uh, grooving. I've let the game run a couple days. We are now about halfway through day 16. I researched, or I went ahead and researched. We upgraded the bedroom upgrade, and we also did the influence cap. We're also working on the step ladder for the maintenance room, and I will start to work on this column of items to research. So in this episode today, I plan on expanding the bedrooms and building our leader, his divine sanctum. So let's go ahead and jump on in, and we're going to start by building those new bedrooms. So let's go ahead and add a little bit of foundation here. We can do, um, let's see, I want it to be four, so that's five, ten, plus a hallway of two. Let's go ahead and do a, a size 12 on foundation. Oops, and we need to make that just a little bit bigger. So we will do, 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 size 12, there we go, all right, so that's like that. Let's go ahead and start building our bedroom walls. So I want, here we go, one, two, and then this to be four, so like that, and then we should just have to mirror this, so hallway of two, and there we go, hallway of two. All right, look at these little dorm rooms we're building for our dentist. Sounds like they're going to be going to the, the chapel here in a second, and we're going to have to expand that a little bit. That, that's okay. We'll clean that up in a second. Put that there. All right, so, oops. Ooh, I should have made this one longer. You know what? We'll just leave, a, there'll be no room here. So let's go ahead and go back up to foundation. Expand this a little bit, and we'll just build that out just like that. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. And we'll go back to walls here. So I want the hallway to continue this way. So we can put that there. That's just our marker. Right? No, it's only a one-width hallway. So, okay, we need that there. Let's go ahead and demolish. Oops, delete wall. Uh, why did you not delete? There we go. That's what we wanted to delete. All right, so we did mess that up a little bit, but that's okay. We can leave that just like that. Let's go ahead and put our bedroom doors in. So one bedroom, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we need to make sure we squeeze two more bedrooms in here. So let's go ahead and go back to walls, and we will build this like that. Put that there. I am reversing that. That's okay. So we'll just and then put that eventually like that. So that'll look a little weird till we can build that way going up north or what I'm gonna call north. So we'll go ahead and select our door. So that's bedroom number nine and then the leader's room and divine sanctum we're gonna put over here. You know, I wish these dentists would just wash their darn hands. They learned that in dental school. Ugh. All right, so let's go back to foundation. Keep expanding. So let's just go ahead and expand it out to there. Perfect, all right. So I'm gonna go ahead and pause. Actually, let her come in. I want her to go out. Please leave the room there. Amy, freeze and shh. 
Charlotte Chaplin. You guys are messing things up. Ugh. All right, they're just gonna stay there, whatever. So we can go ahead and delete these three bits here. Perfect. And let's go back to walls. All right, now we're gonna pause it. So door space. And put that like that. And then we'll put a door here. Fantastic. All right, so let's go to objects, or no, rooms. We'll go to rooms. Let's go ahead and put down our bedrooms. So two bedrooms there. Bunch of bedrooms here. Bunch of bedrooms there. Perfect. And then we can go ahead and unassign all of this as a room. Yeah, I know. And then we can go ahead and go to objects. And we're going to go to bedrooms. So we researched the basic bed, a little bit nicer of a bed. And we're going to plop that there. So everyone gets a nice basic bed for their room. Plop that there and plop that there. Now let's spin it and then we're going to go ahead and build out these rooms. Perfect. And then everyone needs a locker. So we'll put the lockers right there. And then, oops, this room's not right, but we'll put that there. So, all right, we got a basic bedroom. It's not very big. It's not very comfortable, but it's, it's a place to start. Let's just go ahead and delete all these objects and get these out of the way. Perfect. So much to delete. All right, so we will save that plant and we'll save that mirror for our glorious leader. Did I screw that up too? Let's go back to build here. Walls. Oh no, that's right, okay. So we will go ahead and build our divine sanctum over here and we're gonna give uh, Tooth McScrubbers a very nice bedroom of his own. So I was thinking, so we're gonna go back to rooms. Actually, let's go back to walls. Now let's just go ahead and plan this out. So I want a hallway of two. So like that. And then he's gonna get, uh, what do we, how do we wanna do this? Maybe split it? Yeah, let's split it like this. And then we'll do bedroom and divine sanctum there. So door, pop a door here. And we'll pop a door there and a door there as well. Fantastic. Now we can go ahead and mark our rooms. So again, bedroom here for tooth mix scrubbers. Put that there. And then let's find the divine sanctum. Did I pass it? Dental office, spirit chamber. I must have passed it. Oh, where, oh, where did the divine, a oh, leader sanctum. Eh, same thing. And then we'll do leader's sanctum there. And we'll go ahead and move the plant and the mirror into his bedroom. Let's go ahead and go to bedroom and obviously a basic bed and storage for his room and then move object. And since he's tooth mix scrubbers, he deserves nothing but the best. We'll give him a mirror and we'll put a potted plant there. Let's just check out the prestige of his room. It's going up. It's going up very slowly. I'm thinking we give him, uh, not floor, let's go to rugs. I think he needs a rug for the Fellowship of Friendly Floss. We'll just plop that right there with the, the beautiful symbol on it. And let's see if we have any ornaments. Ooh, a disco ball. Um, no, we'll hang on to the disco ball for now. But let's go ahead and check our lights. Light, light. Make sure everyone has a light in their room so they can at least see what's going on. And it's not dark and dingy in there. There we go. All right, everyone gets a light in their room. And then we'll just go ahead and put some lights in the hallway. Make this nice and bright. Perfect. And then up, we'll keep going up this way. Some lights here. And we'll put one there. All right, this is kind of dingy over here. Let's light this up a little bit. And then we'll go here and there. All right, that's a little, little better lit. And it's still kind of dark in here. And we'll light that up a little bit as well. All right, there we go. A little more lighting in there for everyone. I do like the standing lamp. So let's put a standing lamp next to his bed so he can read the any books he wants to read while he's in there. Let's see, ornaments, we already looked in there. Pictures, do we have a picture we can put in there? Oh, of course, he has to have a picture of himself above his bed. So we'll go ahead and plop that down there. Now let's go ahead and build the leader's sanctum. Now we need a couple objects for that. 
Obviously, he needs a desk so he can write all of his great works on there. A mixing table for what? I don't know. We'll have to find out. Can't even pronounce that one, but that one's going to go, how about right here? And then a shelf of artifacts. Uh, let's put that, we'll put that over here as well. All right, so we got our leader's sanctum built. We'll go ahead and get that going again. And we should have finished the stepladder, which increases check speed in the maintenance room. So we'll go ahead and install that in a second. Next, let's go ahead and research. What do we want to research next, guys? Maybe the, let's do the maggot rejuvenation therapy room. So we'll go ahead and get that starting. And then we'll back out, back out. And let's go to objects here and pick our maintenance room perfect and then step ladder and we'll plop that down over here there we go Ooh, that was two thousand dollars for that step ladder must have been the best step ladder in the world and looks like amy leaf is ready to upgrade again so we'll go ahead and upgrade her and she is now at her max level amy leaf capping out well there we go there's our new uh sleeping arrangements for our cult excuse me our dentists they're not cult members so I think that's pretty good for them. Let's see what Amy has to say here. Different Amy. Um, button basher, clumsy. I mean, it's an awful room, yeah, but it's a room, your own room nonetheless. So we'll go ahead and let that keep going there. Now, let's go ahead and go to Divine Inspirations. And we could do the Solace of Darkness. Unlocks Darkness theme plus 50 rating. And this is what we've uh, unlocked in our Sanctum, Leader Sanctum. So we'll go ahead and start investigating that. New theme starts you on the path of darkness. We've got to start somewhere. So he'll, our uh, tooth scrubbers, there he is, is already in there and doing that research for us. We've got four broken items. I don't know where Belle is at, but she needs to start fixing some of this stuff for us. That's what we have her as our maintenance tech for. Let's see if we can find her. I got a broken item there. Bob, no, where's Bella at? She's all the way over here. Bella, my dear. I need you to come over here and fix that. All right, so let's go ahead and go to missions, see what we can do in the mission screen. Go to Gossip Face at the newspaper. Let's see, can we send Amy? She's only got a 16% chance of finishing that mission, so let's uh, let's hang off on that. Let's go ahead and back out of that. All right, so they're just moving in a groove and then getting all that done. I think once they go to bed, we can go ahead and play off their schedules a little bit. Excuse me. We are talking about maybe staggering uh, uh, in the morning what they do and what they don't do, just to make things easier. All right, Bella, this is starting to annoy me. I need you over here to fix these, my girl. There we go. So she can go over there and fix that for us. How are we doing on money? Three grand, okay. Coming back up a little bit. Someone else is ready to upgrade. Amy, you are ready to upgrade, so we're going to go ahead and buff up your improv and planning and she is at max level as well we need to keep increasing our um, pr so we can get better dentists in our fellowship of friendly floss right now everyone's very poor, or excuse me poor quality um except amy so eventually as we get higher quality we can relieve our current dentist and bring in higher quality dentists to just improve the overall fellowship of friendly floss because that's what's really important making sure we got the best people in our group here. Speaking of the best group, if you've been enjoying this, don't forget to like the video. Comment on down below what you think of uh, Honey, I Joined a Cult. Let me know. I'm going to get rid of that bush there because that's starting to bother me. So let's just go to Move Object. See if I can move that bush to right there. There we go. And we're going to move this flower as well. All right. And then really, if you've been enjoying this content and want to get it on time in an orderly fashion, don't forget to subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. So you get it, like I said, on time and in an orderly fashion. All right, so everyone's asleep here. Let's go ahead and pause really quick, and we're going to go to our dentist, and let's go to their schedule. All right, so gray is sleeping, blue is free time, where they're allowed to do whatever they want, and red is working. So Tooth McScrubbers, I'm not too concerned on when he's doing his thing, but we want everyone to have blue during the sermon hour, so we're going to leave that alone. Now, we know Bella here. I'd almost rather her work night. So let's do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then we're going to have her sleep 
from here. Well, we'll want her to use the bathroom in that before she goes to bed. So we're gonna have her sleep. One, two, three, four, five. Oops, hold on, I wanna redo this. So that needs to be free. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So let's do free time here and here. So she wakes up, can use the bathroom in that, and then she can go work for a little bit, come to the sermon, work the rest of the night, and then have a little bit of free time. And then we'll, we'll hold on, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11. They got them working 11 hours a day, huh? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Okay, so that now makes sense. So free time there, there. And then let's just go ahead and we're gonna give her an hour off and we'll give her some free time right before she goes to bed. So she'll be out fixing things during the night while everyone's working. Now I wanna stagger the lunches a little bit more. So let's go ahead and I'm just gonna take randomly these guys on the bottom and they're just gonna work through lunch maybe. So not gonna let me do that. All right, so let's just do that. Why is it not letting me do that? There we go, let's just take these four and they're gonna have an early lunch and then every the, everyone else will maintain their lunch. We'll just switch that there. Now, the morning it's a little congested. Oops, you need to work that hour there. A little congested, but I really can't stagger anyone too much. Actually, it's, who was our cook? Was that Hannah? No, I don't think it's Hannah. I think it's Charlotte, our cook, right? Let's go here and check. Yep, okay, so maybe Charlotte. Oops. Well, I can just do it on this screen here. So maybe Charlotte can have a schedule similar to Bella? Maybe that's what we do, let's do that. Um, it's still gonna leave them clogged in the morning, huh? Okay, so let's do work, work, free time, free time there. All right, and then Charlotte is going to have the same schedule as Bella. So work, 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 work to here and then some free time. We'll give her three hours of free time. And then you're gonna sleep throughout the day. And then free time, free time. Work, work, work. All right, I, I like that. That's a little bit more staggered. We got some people taking an early lunch, some people working the night shift. So one, two, three, four, five people working uh, that and that. All right. Um, and you know what? Let's do this. JK, let's go back to this. Man, two hours for break in the middle of the day? Maybe we move to, let's move these two people back. So let's do work, 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 work. And then lunch, 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 lunch. And that should keep our rooms open most of the time. Yeah, I like that. All right, let's get that clock rolling here. Missions, we don't want to have any missions. There we go, so um, looks like Charlotte and Bella are back out to work. They might be a little cranky today because they're gonna get short shifted or short shorted their sleep, but that's okay. Now, Charlotte, you are supposed to be cooking. Pretty sure I signed you as a cook. Maybe there's nothing to cook. Let's go ahead and go order and we'll order our max ingredients. And all right, yep, now she should go do some cooking for us. Fantastic, she'll make that gruel so everyone has it when they wake up. All right, Bella, fix that toilet and they'll have a good meal when they wake up in the morning. All right, so done quite a bit so far. We've fiddled with the bedrooms, got our uh, tooth mix scrubbers, a great bedroom, and his sanctum. And we expanded, uh, or not expanded, changed the shifts around. So that's pretty good. Liking that so far. How are we doing on research? About three quarters away there or so. Yeah, 27 to 48. Okay, so that's moving along nicely. Haven't been able to do any missions yet. Divine Inspiration, I'm guessing he'll finish that here today soon. Got full dentist and full followers. 
That's good. Someone needs to, Bella needs to fix that research desk. There you go. Or is he fixing it for us? Bob Robinson, I didn't know you were assigned as a maintenance tech, but that's okay. You can go out and fix that. I appreciate all your hard work. Something, oh, divine inspiration. All right, so let's go ahead and finish that. And we can do dark object acquisition mission or the pentagram top. Well, of course, we're going to go ahead and research that. It's a new outfit. Dennis can now wear a new outfit, changeable in the cult overview customization screen. So go ahead and start investigating that, please, Tooth McScrubbers. Would appreciate that greatly. That toilet is still broken. I guess Bella's probably sleeping, right? Charlotte's sleeping. Where's Bella at? Bella, my dear, you should be sleeping. Bob, where's she at? Oh, she... <gasps> Bella, how dare you sleep in Tooth McScrubber's bed? That is not your room. I probably should have assigned that to him. So we're just going to go ahead and assign that. And Bella, you get your butt out of there. That is for Tooth McScrubber's only. How dare you? Ugh, people these days. You just can't can't get, can't get them uh, to do what they're supposed to do. They just do whatever they want. Ah, dentists these days. So horrible. So horrible. All right, so we're on day 18, about halfway through. Money is rolling in again. Divine inspiration's going up, research going up. Well, I think this is a good spot to go ahead and hold on the episode. We did quite a bit today. Uh, we messed with the schedule, got Tooth McScrubbers his chambers, uh, both his fantastic bedroom, and we'll zoom in on it here with that photo, and his uh, cult sanctum, leader sanctum. So... Got the bedrooms built for everyone, individual bedrooms. And then we messed with their schedule. So we are cruising right along here in the cult. So again, if you've enjoyed this content, don't forget to like the video. Comment on down below on what you want me to keep doing, both here in Honey, I Joined a Cult and other games. I know we've talked about uh, the next game I want to play will probably be... Um, hmm, I'm blanking on the name. Golly. Um... Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. I can't remember. Craft of the World. There we go. I got it. Probably do some Craft of the World here soon. And then I think I got another idea of a game I want to do. I already played a little bit of the demo on this channel, but the full release was last week, two weeks ago now. Uh, so I want to go ahead and visit that and bring that round. So again, comment on down below on any of that. Still looking on commentary on audio quality, video quality, anything to help me improve the channel. And if you want to stick around and see the channel grow and become very successful, greatly successful, don't forget to subscribe, subscribe, there we go, to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get all this great content on time in an orderly fashion. Thank you so much for coming out, and we'll see you in the next Honey, I Joined a Cult video.